Hello students, welcome to your chemistry classmate. In today's session, we shall learn about one more balancing method that is algebraic method. In the last session, we learned about balancing of hydrocarbons burning reactions, especially combustion reactions. Now, in this session, we shall concentrate one more method that is algebraic method. This is very important, very easy and very interesting method to balance the chemical equation because uh, during the practicing you must be aware about the chemical equation balancing so it is very easy and important so shall discuss this observe here CH4 plus O2 gives CO2 plus H2O so this is the equation now how many moles of CH4 how many moles of O2 we don't know similarly how many moles of CO2 how many moles of H2 we don't know that is why let us consider a moles of CH4 reacts with B moles of O2 gives C moles of CO2 D moles of H2O. Is it okay? So, A moles of CH4 B moles of O2. So, whatever it is the equation that is not the matter, just concentrate on the balancing part only. Now, in any chemical equation, you know that left side number of atoms and right side number of atoms must be equal. That is why, see, left side, how many, see, in, how many types of atoms are there here? First of all, carbon atoms, hydrogen atoms, and oxygen atoms. In entire equation, three different types of atoms only. Carbon, hydrogen, oxygen. Now, carbon, how many, left side, how many carbon atoms are there? Only A carbon atoms. Because A moles of CH4 we considered. That is why A. Definitely left side carbon atoms must be equal to right side carbon atoms. That is where right side how many carbon atoms are there? Here also see there only one carbon atom. In the compound carbon atom not there. So that is why A equal to C. Is it clear? Now look at the next atom that is hydrogen. Left side how many hydrogen atoms are there? Four hydrogen atoms. That is why 4 into A. That is why 4A equal to. Because in this O2 there is no hydrogen. Right side, how many hydrogens are there? Two hydrogen. That is why 2 into D. 2 into D. Is it clear? Now, look at the oxygen. Left side, how many oxygen atoms are there? Two oxygen atoms. But 2 into B. Because that factor of how much we don't know. That is why 2B equal to right side, how many? In this compound, oxygen is there. Two oxygen atoms. That is why 2C. But in this compound, also oxygen is there. That is why we have to add this number of oxygens also. How many oxygens are there here? One oxygen atom is there. One oxygen atom, but it is a D. That is why plus a D. So you got the four equations, three equations. One, two, three. Three equations you got. Now your work is find the A, B, C values, A, B, C, D values. Uh, for that purpose, so we shall consider let A equal to 10. So except 0, you can consider any number. So why I choose 10 here? Because it has more factors, 2 and 5 and 1. So, because of that flexibility, I consider A equal to 10. So, if A equal to 10 from equation 1, from equation 1, what will get here? From equation 1, automatically, therefore, C equal to 10. Because A equal to C. Is it clear? Now, A value you got and it's C value also you got. Now, uh, if you want to get the remaining, uh, which is the flexible here, see there. look at the second equation. Uh, if you substitute A value, you will get the D value. That is why 4 into 10 equal to 2D. So, what will get here? D equal to 40 by nothing but will get 20. So, D value got. Now, A value, C value, D value got. So, remaining, observe the equation 3. From here, if you substitute the remaining values, 2b equal to 2c that means 2 into 10 already we got plus d nothing but 20 so what will get here 2b equal to 20 plus 20 so 40 then b equal to 20 see there all the values you got now substitute here now substitute here a ch4 what is the first equation we considered skeletal equation a ch4 in the place of a so here only we shall do in the place of a in the place of a what is the value 10? So 10 CH4 plus B value how much we got 20. So 20 O2 gives C value how much we got 10. That is why 10 CO2 plus D value 20. 20 H2O. 
is it clear now if you simplify because all numbers are cancelled with 5 that is why 10 by 5 20 by 5 10 by 5 20 by 5 what will get here 2 CH4 plus uh, 20 volt nothing but 4 volt uh, you can cancel 10 also what is the reason because all the numbers will be cancelled by 10 that is why we can't we can take it CH4 plus 20 volt nothing but 2O2 gives 10 CO nothing but CO2 plus 20H2 nothing but 2H2. This is the balancing equation. Is it clear? So this is the very simplest method uh, while doing the chemical equations, while interacting with the chemical equations within 5 minutes. So if it is the simplest equation within seconds based on your practice we can do it. Otherwise within short span of time we can solve the these all equations very easily so we shall try for one more equation we shall try for one more equation